Hey, all you pet parents out there. My brother Phil is obsessed with his dog, Katie, and she is adorable, but I think his kids are a little jealous of how much he spoils her. Truth be told, I am kind of in love with Katie too, so I have decided to make her a very big, comfy dog bed for Christmas. Now, this is a great upcycling project because you can use an old sofa cushion as the base. And everybody has a friend who's moving out of their apartment and getting rid of their sofa or just putting it on the street. So make sure to grab those cushions for your next dog bed project. Now we're putting this all together with some of my favorite products. And as usual, I'm gonna leave a link to everything I used in the description below. Now don't forget to thumbs up if you like this video and leave me a comment if you have a question about how I put it together. And as always, I love hearing from you in the comments, so make sure to pop in and say hello. Are you ready? Let's make a dog bed for Katie. The experts are still not sure, but it seems to be between 10 and 30,000 years ago that dog beds were invented when wolves were domesticated into pets. Did you know that dogs sleep between 12 and 18 hours a day, depending on their age? So they actually need a comfy bed to snooze in, just like you do. Faux fur first appeared in 1929 using alpaca hair. Modern fake furs were developed in the 1950s with acrylic polymers replacing alpaca hair. I'm gonna leave a link to Fairfield World and Sherbonder and everything I used for this project in the description below. Thumbs up if you like this video, leave me a comment and I will get back to you. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and press the notification bell so that you know I have a new video. Grab any one of my craft books for inspiration. I think you'll like the Big Ass Book of Crafts Volume 2 and I'll see you next week. Bye.